Man, this is some beautiful weather we've been having lately. I love it. Yeah, dude. Thank God it finally cleared up, though. You do too, don't you, Steve-O? Uh, do what? Thank God, dude. You do thank God for these wonderful gifts, don't you? Come on, Chris. You know I don't really buy into all that religion stuff. I guess you could say I'm an atheist at heart. What did you say, dude? An atheist? That's impossible, dude. I know you. You're a good dude. Wait a sec. Are you implying that it's impossible for an atheist to be a decent, caring human being? Morals, Steve-O. Morals. For you see, it is the Bible that gives us our sense of right and wrong. It is what guides us through the troubled, murky waters of our existence. It is a road map to living a good life. Without it, mankind would be lost in a sea of wickedness and sin. There would be no good in the world. Just greed and lust and terribleness, dude. Huh. Okay, so let me just ask you a question. If I cast a magic spell on you right now and completely removed your belief in God and the Bible, do you think that that would cause you to behave any differently? If I stopped believing in God, I would go to the zoo, find the baby panda nursery, douse it in gasoline, and torch that freaking thing right down to the ground. Oh, yeah. Burn. Burn, baby pandas. Burn. <laughs> Are you done? Naturally, I would cap it all off by pulling out my machete and systematically stabbing and chopping and killing every random person in sight until a highly trained team of snipers finally puts me down, dude. So, the only reason you aren't doing any of this right now, my ticket, dude. I want to earn my way into fantasy land when I die. Heaven is my reward for not reaping and killing, dude. Fear of punishment and hope for a special reward are what makes me a good person. Wow, let's all uh, hope you never stop believing in God then, huh? I am starting to feel my faith slipping from me. Alright, I just remembered, I got a dentist appointment. Uh, see ya!